Home gardeners aren't always sure what the weather will deliver from one year to the next. And that was certainly the case for one local homeowner. He got a surprise so great that he made a call to News Channel 15's Drew Blair. This garden is something to see as it is. 85 feet of produce tucked in an urban Fort Wayne backyard. This year, though, it's not the size of the garden that's so impressive. From corn to tomatoes, Jim Keefe's garden is bigger than most, so is its bounty. A couple of weeks ago, uh, my wife came out to check it out, and she noticed uh, a very humongous looking something or other, and we quite, didn't quite know what it was. The something or other? A cantaloupe. This is a very unusual cantaloupe. Yes, a cantaloupe. A group of five or six of them, actually. The biggest of the bunch weighs at least 40 pounds. That's 45 inches uh, this way, and it's 39 inches that way. What'd you do to get them so big? Well, I have no idea. I did nothing. Absolutely nothing. Sandy soil, water, and time, and this is what he got. In comparison to this one, Quite a difference. Ten times the size and no secret, except for maybe the seeds. I found a pack of seeds in my garage that had been there for quite some time. Jim called the local branch of the USDA, which plans to study the cantaloupes. It will figure out whether the magnificent melons are genetically twisted or just a fluke. Either way, as long as the fruit's edible, it won't go to waste. Well, I might just take them down to the mission and give those guys a Treat, take three or four days to feed that group. They'll probably take care of a squad of Marines. By the way, all the other corn, tomatoes, peppers, everything else in here, all regular sized. In Fort Wayne, Drew Blair, News Channel 15.